Hey YouTube, I'm in the women's room checking my lipstick. You know I'm in my bathroom. And I said, a women's room talk. You know what I don't really understand is the, the majority of women who love to talk to me about their periods after they find I'm trans. Like, I don't know if they think I'm not educated to what happens during a period. I don't know if they think that I want to hear about it. I don't know if they think that I think that I'm missing something. I don't know if they... Th I don't give a fuck about your period. I don't... Mm. And I just want to kind of like make that clear as we have kind of a quick bathroom break and we're in the women's room. Like, ladies, I love y'all. I respect y'all. Listen, I'm sad that in the beginning of my life, I was not born with the benefit that you're born with. I'm sad sometimes that I had to struggle and that I had to go through hell and that I had to go through a journey that everybody put roadblocks and uh, stop signs and they put uh, explosions and they put cones up and they put, you know, I went through hell on earth to be the woman I am today. Hell on earth. And I'm damn sure, sure that you don't want to hear about the struggles that I had to go through to become a woman. You don't want to hear how I had to start going to psychological evaluations, how I was hospitalized for suicide. Um, you don't want to hear about how I was put on uh, hormone treatments when I was 15 as an experimental guinea pig. Started off with testosterone and then nothing. You don't, I, I, I don't understand if you think that I... And missing something, if I'm lacking something, or if I really want to hear a graphic detail summary about your period. I don't want to hear about it. And I've not really met a trans woman that does. Ones that have transitioned anyway. I mean, in the trans community, you're going to always have people that are envious that wishes they could get a period because they want to be women. I understand that. But when you kind of become one... And there's lots of women that don't have periods. You realize it doesn't really make or break you as a woman. But I've realized that people love to put things in your face. Like, oh, my period's so bad, blah, blah, blah. Like, is it supposed to make me feel any type of way? It doesn't. At least you haven't had to take a half lifetime of hormone treatments. And, and feel what puberty pregnancy menopause symptoms feel like all at the same time for several years so anyway that's my little bathroom break vent to y'all i love y'all women i do i think y'all wonderful not in that type of way because girl no honey there ain't nothing no woman can do for me no i do like my man but mm -mm. But as a sister coming to you, as a woman, as a sister coming to you, you don't have to discuss your periods with me because I'm not missing out on anything. I promise you. And I don't want to hear about them. Thank you so much for tuning in to this topic here on the Bam and Nicole. Hope I didn't lose any of my female subscribers from that. I just wanted to tell you, you really shouldn't discuss that with your local transgender friend. Have a nice day. Hope you comment, like, share, and subscribe. Bye.